Hey guys, welcome to Life's Traction Control. Today I'm going to talk a little bit about a couple of bowling balls that I drilled this week. Uh, the first one being the new one, well not really that new, but the Trek Tundra, one of the weaker pieces. I needed some stuff to be able to play a little bit straighter, be able to close my angles down and not have something that overreacts too much off of the dry. So this was my option. Obviously I, I use switch grip in everything that I own. And I just switched all my equipment over to the new Classic Pro uh, more firm grips that we carry. So if you haven't tried those yet, I, cons I would consider doing that. Uh, here is the Pin Up Tundra. It's about a 5.5 inch layout, standing 20. Looking at about 12 out to about 7. And you can see it's just super clean through the front part of the lane. It doesn't try to overread in the middle. And it just comes off the spot and goes through the pins properly rather than overhooking or underhooking and doing weird things so here is the pin down version basically the same layout just pin down instead standing in the same spot same everything for the most part you see it reaches the middle of the lane just a little pinch more than the pin up one did and then uh, slows down going through the pins so then I drilled the kinetic emerald standing in the same spot with this ball this one also is a pin up, and you'll see it actually reads the middle of the lane quite a bit more than the Tundra did. But it, uh, it is quite a bit jer more jerky down lane too, so quite a bit stronger ball out of the Kinetic Emerald. Uh, here I'll actually make a small move and go 2 and one further left on this shot. And you'll see it still really gets through the pins. So that's what you get out of the Tundra and the Kinetic Emerald. Both two of the new pieces come out by track right now. So for me, I would say the uh, the two combination there, the, the Tundra and the Kinetic, are going to go really well together. Um, be able to switch to the Kinetic whenever I need something just a little bit stronger. And when I want to go a little straighter, I can actually stay with the Tundra uh, with the two options there. So that'll be good. Um, stay tuned. I'm actually going to drill and do a couple of videos on the GB2 Phenom Pearl and we'll compare it to the Phobia in the next video I do here later this week sometime. So stay tuned and have a good day y'all. This was Life's Traction Control.